hello everyone uh, welcome to simplify this nice algebraic expression so we have 1 over 8 and its whole power 1 over 8 so we uh, write this into the simplified form so here uh, first uh, we write this into the radical form so we have 1 over 8 into 8th the 1 over 8 be the 8th root so we write it as in this form okay uh, because we know that if you have uh, a into whole power 1 over n it is written as the nth root of a okay we write this exponential form into the radical form so uh, after that uh, here we apply another uh, nice radical formula you know that if we have a over b and its nth root it is written as nth root of a divided by nth root of b so according to this formula we write this term as nth root of 1 is divided by nth root of 8 okay so we know that uh, nth root of 1 is equals to 1 divided by uh, 8th root of 8 so after that here we use another nice form, uh, radical formula and we know about this formula if you have uh, 1 over nth root of a so we write this expression as uh, it is if we, we just multiply this term as a to the power of n minus 1 uh, and its nth root divided by a to the power of n minus 1 and its nth root okay so now if you focus on this term so we have uh, it is the 8th root it means that we multiply this term by uh, 8 to the power of 8 minus 1 okay we write this term as 1 over 8th root of 8 is multiplied by 8 to the power of 8 minus 1 and its 8th root divided by 8 to the power of 8 minus 1 and its 8th root okay so after this step here we multiply uh, the 1 by this term and it is written as so here you see that we have 8 to the power of 8 minus 1 and 8 minus 1 is equals to 8 to the power of 7 and its 8th root divided by uh, here we have 8th root of 8 into this is 8 minus 1 becomes 8 to the power of 7 into 8th root so here you see that uh, uh, if we have a to the power of nth root into b to the power of nth root so that we just combine these two roots and we write it as a multiplied by b and its nth root okay so we use here this nice radical formula uh, to the denominator of this term okay so now we apply this formula on the denominator and it is written as 8 to the power of 7 into 8th root divided by here we just combine the 8th root here and we write it as 8 is multiplied by 8 to the power of 7 into 8th root and after this step here we see that the exponent of this 8 is 1 and now we apply the uh, nice exponential and you know that if we have a to the power of m into a to the power of n it is equals to a to the power of m plus n we use this nice uh, exponential in the denominator of this term and uh, the denominator of this term is written as in this form 8 to the power of 7 and its 8th root divided by here we add the exponents of these two terms and it is written as 1 plus 7 and its 8th root okay so here uh, after this step uh, we have 8 to the power of 7 into 8th root divided by 8 to the power of 8 into 8th root okay so now uh, after this step uh, we uh, you see here uh, if uh, here we apply the another uh, radical exponential law we know that if you have a to the power of n into nth root it is equals to a it means that this n and nth root are cancelled by each other okay so we get a only similarly uh, if uh, you see here you uh, see that this 8 and 8th root are cancelled by each other and we get 
8 to the power of 7 into 8th root divided by here and uh, when you cancel these terms uh, exponential radical then you get here only 8 so now uh, here uh, we write this our base 8 into the uh, prime factor form and you know that the prime factors of 8 are so we have 2 4 is 8 2 2 is 4 and 2 1 is 2 so it means that we write our 8 is a 2 to the power of 3 okay now here we just replace this 8 by 2 to the power of 3 and it is written as 2 to the power of 3 and its exponent 7 and its 8th root divided by 2 to the power of 3 okay so after this step uh, here we use another exponential line and you know that if we have a to the power of m to the power of n it is equals to a to the power of m times of n here we use this nice exponential law uh, so that according to this law we multiply these two exponents and it is written as 2 to the power of 21 and its eighth root divided by 2 to the power of 3 so uh, further in the next step uh, here uh, you see that if we have a to the power of m into nth root so we write this expression as a to the power of m over n it means that here we just convert our radical form uh, into the exponential form by using the by using the this law okay so according to this law here we convert uh, this radical and exponent this radical form into this exponential form so we write it as 2 to the power of 21 over 8 and it is divided by 2 to the power of 3 okay so uh, after this step uh, we have uh, another law so you know that if we have a to the power of m over a to the power of n it is written as a to the power of m minus n so now we use here this nice uh, power division law so uh, according to this law you see here the basis on both of these terms are same so we uh, just subtract the exponent of numerator here and it is written as 2 to the power of 21 over 8 minus 3 and now we take the LCM of the exponent so the LCM of exponent is 8 and it is written as 21 minus 24 because 8 3 is a 24 and now we write uh, this expression as 2 to the power of 21 minus 24 equals to minus 3 over 8 and now we move this minus 3 over 8 in the downside and it is written as 1 over 2 to the power of plus 3 over 8 okay this negative exponent become a positive exponent and now we again write this into the radical form or you just say that this is the our final answer or we write this uh, expression as in this form 1 over uh, 2 to the power of 3 into 8th root okay so this is the final answer and thank you so much for watching this video please subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos